Hello lovelies, it is Sony back with Dream Home Decorator. Now, we had some uh, issues last episode. Where is everybody? Who can I say hello to? Is anybody here? Hello? Hello? Is, 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 is it empty? I didn't think you could come come into a lot when there was nobody here well this is super helpful so I wanted to come to the party house because this is our next gig we are renovating it tomorrow at nine enter build mode and make renovations what have I just ruined? Oh. Have I just ruined the whole thing? By I pressed on the hotkeys by accident and went into build mode. Maybe you can't visit then when you're going to be renovating. Well, I guess we might as well just go home then. I wanted to visit and get to know the party house people because I wanted to to get to know their kind of their likes and maybe the colours that they liked because the last two decorator gigs we've had we've had zero money and I thought maybe it was because I didn't know anybody and it was just grim but let's see let's we might as well just buy some stuff now we're here and we're, now we're back home so we need a toilet Let's buy this and can we buy how much was the food thing? Um was it one forty or something? The picnic basket I don't think is any good. There we go, the hamper. Um the picnic basket you have to put stuff into it. Right, so we now we've got a toilet that we can use and we've got a hamper that we can get some um food out of. And then I guess after that, we might as well just go to sleep. So she's getting up. She's going to have some cereal. And then it will nearly be time for our gig. Let's go to work and getting that on time can be a good opportunity to get to know the clients likes and dislikes well we will try so let's see if we can find some people here we go friendly introduction oh oh jumping around is that hi how are you now, please, how about we like do a bit of a chat first? Bright and day, enthused about design vision, thank for opportunity. You know, because we are, um, we are pretty, pretty low down on the, um, on our reputation. We're only okay. So if we don't do this right, then I feel like we're we're just throwing away the opportunity. Right, she's got a bit of charisma skill up. We're getting a little bit of, uh, you know, we're acquaintances, but at least it's in the green. So now please, can you tell me something that is good, you know? A thing that you like. Do you like a colour? Look, we've got all these colours here. Any of them that you like? Give me just one, you know, one. Oh, we've got a like. Fantastic. Right, let's introduce ourselves to, to Marcus. So we like patio decor. And we're doing a room. Oh, no, no. Don't go and use your punching bag, please. I want to introduce myself because you need to give me something that you also like. 
So friendly introduction. Oh, hello, Paolo. Friendly introduction. Now, heartfelt compliment. Get to know. Brighten day. Well, maybe not promise a successful renovation. Ask to see Simtress board. So I would like to, um, you know, see your ideas as well. Because Jade here likes patio decor, which is an interesting choice, but it's least, at least it's something that we like. So come on, Paolo, what do you like? Please tell me. He's like, yeah, here's, here's my iPad. These are the things that I like. We can show Marcus our portfolio. He gave me nothing. Okay, that's fine. The Paolo, see, I get the... Um, from him, I just think he's easy going, he's laid back. He'd probably be happy with anything. So, uh, we like fitness. Ask about favourite designs. Come on, we just need one more. Fitness, patio decor. Come on, a colour would be good. You know, just anything to um, tie this all together. He's like, mm, there's some leaves there, there's this countertop. I like this pink bed. Oh, green. Oh, fantastic. Right. Send client away. So we've got to know the clients a little bit. And we want to do a room renovation. Suddenly have a few simoleons. We'd like to change things. Okay, so. Does it matter where we are decorating. Does it tell me anywhere? Room renovation. No new tiles allowed. Okay, so it could be any room. I'm just double checking that I'm not missing some information like from last time. So it can be any room. We've got 7,000. And I mean, if you like green, there's not a lot of green going on here. Should we do the kit, the whole kitchen? Maybe we should just go for it. Let's go for it and let's just delete everything and start again. Okay, so we've got a nice blank space. I think I would like to change the flooring. We'll do some, so green, patio decor and fitness. So if I do, some, maybe floorboards would go with the vibe if we keep the walls, not these walls cause they're a bit, they're, I think they're a bit too colorful. We could do this green or, oh, that's a bit minty looking. Right, let's just, let's just filter by colour and go green, see what we've got. I think this is the, uh, the Johnny Zest green that I did. See, I quite like it. Maybe we could... Do I want to do it all green? Is that a bit much? And then just leave this kind of outside this section brick. I mean, it's I mean, it's green, definitely. I think I'd quite like the kitchen to be here. I'm going to move things around a little bit. Why don't we look for all of patio stuff and just see what shows shows up 
and then just make sure we use some of this. Right, we could put a couple of these hedges here and then we could have the dining table in front. What about the chairs and things? Do we have a dining table? We do, patio chic. I don't know that I like that with the table. Is this a, like a coffee table? It is. Is this a dining table? It is. Okay, so if we pop that there, like this maybe, and then we get some of the table, tables, dear me. We get some of the chairs, these ones. I guess so. Eek, I'm not sure about maybe these ones. Okay. So six chairs. Um, is there any kind of oh, there's some plants. This might be nice by all of the gosh, it's like doors. Oh, that's a window. For some reason, I thought that was a door. that fit there it's kind of huge I do kind of like it though okay we'll leave that there for the moment okay so I've picked out some patio things and some green things and I've just popped them around the place I thought we could use this is a patio decor bar so we could use the same counters um, for the kitchen these ones i i'm not a fan of all of these windows i have to say because i don't really like putting counters in front of um windows like that and I know I am making like a really kind of small space now. But I do, I kind of like little, little kitchens. Um, I think the green fridge is probably a little bit much. You know, I'm, I'm not a huge fan of green, I have to say, but... Um, I don't mind I don't mind it I'm getting I'm getting used to it and but I think there's a limit on the amount of green that you can use because there's so many different shades so is that that way around yes it is can I move that in so it joins up there put an extra one in in case I need it and then put that there do I want that no I do not okay so we've got a little bar we've got the kitchen we need a bin and um, maybe the little, the little one there, the little bin. We also need a sink. And they did have lots of kind of, not a platter, well, like little, um, coffee machine and things like that. So maybe we could add those, add those in as well. So they don't feel like we've uh, taken everything away. You could also put a dishwasher in. Mm, is there a better colour? Is that a better colour? Maybe. Okay, so we put the dishwasher there, or maybe the dishwasher could go on this side where you don't really see it, because I don't like it when it's different colours. I wish they could do like a... 
a built-in dishwasher with the same colour drawer fronts. You know, like you do in real life, you can have like integrated, integrated ones. Um, so a microwave is probably a good idea, and also a um, coffee machine was the other thing. Maybe on that side, have a few decorations and I quite like this tea maybe we could have the tea thing there oh blankets so I've put this sofa in here from the patio stuff and I think I would like to put in a fireplace now this is kind of a funky kind of build so I think they would have something industrial looking like this one or would it be white I think I like the darker one there we go and then a nice rug which what is a green options are they all like super super green Yes, is the answer to that. Oh, what about this one? That's quite... That's not too, too green. Um, and TV. Maybe... Is it weird if I put the TV here? I think it feels like it's going to be weird. Oh, I was like, why is there no TVs? It's because the, the TVs are not green. So if you did it like this, and because I can't build any walls, can I? I know I did the exact same thing last time. Oh, I can build a wall. Oh, that's interesting. So I could put the TV on that and this could also be a different colour. Maybe this could be the same brick that we have on the, the outside walls. So it's a bit like a sort of a supporting, a supporting wall. Now we can move our plant over here. So we have this massive climber thing that I never use, but this is actually an open space so I'm now not 100% sure on the green wall but I can do it up here as well maybe I should change it all so it all matches at least so yeah this um this wall climber thing actually fits in this space so we can use it here i feel better now that all the walls are green um and also i need some wall lights i think because it's getting a bit dull so let me just have a look up for green see if anything interesting crops up i mean these kind of look like this they, they sort of fit kind of slightly more industrial looking could maybe put some down the hallway as well because it is a little bit um a little bit dark so you can see where you're going what about like a bookcase or something like that don't think we really need it to be green just something like I mean that is that a bit big that feels a bit massive to be like down the hall maybe one more like that I just feel like there should be something I don't really like that one I don't think I've ever used that See, their doors are green. I never realised that. So, um, 
paintings on the wall. Green. Let's see what we've got. Okay, there we go. I added, added some pictures around the place. Now, is there anything else I need to do? I would like to move some of these things. Oh, coffee table. That's something that we don't have. So this was a patio chic one as well. So we could use this and then put like the lantern. On there. This one on there. Okay. I mean, we've still got 10,000 simoleons left. Maybe we could have a little rug by the door here. Just to um, finish things off. Is this weird? No, I think that's okay. Um, and maybe one more painting over here of something. Maybe these ones. I do like these paintings. I use them quite a lot. Um, right. So, anything else? Maybe we need to continue this flooring. And then another rug or something. We also don't have like a stereo or anything like that. There we go. Music. Um, I mean, we've got this massive thing here. I feel like they would like, you know, they would like uh, some music all around the house. I'm just somewhere else that I can put that. Mm. Not really. It was only because it was green and it was part of the patio stuff. It could maybe go over here by the by the blankets. No, I think we'll sell it. Right, I'm going to call that it. Oh no, I didn't take before photos, did I? <gasps> no, I didn't. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> goodness me, that one, that one. That one, that one. Those two. Those two, those two. Right, I'm going to touch nothing. Because I think last time I was clicking buttons and stuff to change something. So I'm going to touch nothing. We're going to call the clients back. Yes. Right, the clients are here. So we want to reveal renovations to the clients. And let's see if we can actually do any of this. Let's have a look. We're going inside. Oh, I don't think it's worked. Has it worked? Check on client. Oh, yes, it has worked. We didn't get the pictures again, though, which is fine because they they were the same pictures. So we reveal this to client because that's patio stuff. That is um, fitness stuff. This is green patio stuff. Check this out. So we've shown off objects. Let's, oh, there's a person that we didn't actually meet. That doesn't sound good. Discuss interests. Come on, Paolo. Heartfelt compliment. 
brighten your day. See, is a music lover. I I got a I got a stereo. See, look, check this out. I got you a stereo. So heartfelt compliment. You know, I made sure to get you plenty of uh, green fitness patio stuff. So look, stereo Paolo. Oh, I'm ready to wrap this up. Okay. Ask for final verdict. So it was just taking a while. I'm ready to talk about this renovation. I think I've seen enough. Let's get my thoughts. Okay, none of them sound particularly positive, although here is this one's going quite well. So she's looking worried. She's like, oh, I guess you did a good job. It's just not my taste. Oh dear. Ask for final verdict. Come on, you are the one that liked all the patio stuff. So if you don't like it, then I'm concerned. Because basically this was for you. This is looking good. I mean, whatever Paolo's doing, I think is, I think is good. Did she give me my, her final verdict? I feel like she didn't. I mean, we're getting a shake of the hand from... Uh, from Paolo. Ask for final verdict. She's the last one, I think. Yeah, three out of four. Sorry, we didn't ask you anything, actually. But, I mean, you were smiling before, so I hope that means that you like it. Oh, mm, yes, I think so. Oh, she's crying. I think that was three positives and one negative. Oh, what is going on there? I got monies! Oh, look! Sadie has completed the following and has received the following results. Money earned 648, promotion, a professional reputation improved. <gasps> Let's go home and see what's happened. I'm thrilled. Is that because it was like there was more people to ask or because I got likes so I could put things in that they actually liked? Well, I'm now thrilled. So, we are now home. We've been promoted. That's what the extra money was for. Sadie has been promoted to interior design technician. She's received 370 smolling bonus and issues of interior design magazine. <gasps> Fabulous. So now we are average at everything. Which. I wonder what that was. And it's a little tulip flower. Um, which is better than just fine. So. We can have a... Oh, the water's been shut off. Okay, we can use the bathroom. We can have a quick meal. And now we have some money to do a little bit of renovation. So I think we need to build a room. That should be our, our aim. So how much? That's too much. <laughs> how much is too much so that's probably a big enough space and then we need a little door little, let's do a little blue door and can we do a window we could have a nice white window on the side and we'll put a little roof on as well just to you know because roofs are free so why not is there like a blue a blue kind of color oh there's a pink let's have a pink and blue house there we go so i've got a tiny little house she's used the toilet so we can go back in and just move the bed in the toilet can go on one side the sink can go on the other side and then that can just stay outside so we've got our oh we don't have a light can I buy a little ceiling light I can indeed yay so we finally have walls 
So I think I will leave this here. I'm not going to select another gig because after this I'm going to film um, the cottage living. Cottage living? That's what it's called, isn't it? Yeah, cottage living um, let's play. And we are here in the same world. So how cute is that? Yeah, we are in our in the same world. So I if I get a gig now, it'll have disappeared by the time we come back to play this. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. At least we got paid today. So that is thrilling. Give this a like, give me some comments down below and subscribe to see all the future stuff. So thanks again and I will see you next time.